Greenger Power Sports G3S. While most people believe that electric vehicles bring cleaner air and low running cost, Greenger Power Sports decided to turn the latest EV technology into an endless source of fun. Their latest model is a mini supermoto style bike that has a seat height of just 27 inches, an 8.2 inch ground clearance, and a weight of 154 pounds. Despite its compact dimensions, the G3S has a durable twin spar frame that ensures a weight capacity of 300 pounds. The power comes from a 6 kilowatt mid mounted motor with a chain drive and a 72 volt 30 amp hour battery that enables speeds up to 47 miles per hour. The G3S has three performance modes, giving between 40 minutes and two hours of running time. My Super E-Bike Havoc the Havoc was developed by the Czechia-based company to serve a dual purpose, high-speed city commuting and extensive off-road rides. Considering its size and a 230-pound weight, we have to admit that it's probably one of the most versatile and feature-packed lightweight bikes that exist today. The model relies on a mid-mounted 13-kilowatt motor with a chain drive. It can be combined with either a 3.9 or a 4.6-kilowatt-hour battery pack to travel for up to 50 miles. The motor setup peaks at 32 kilowatts, enabling a 0 to 60 mile per hour acceleration in just 4 seconds. To extend the range, you may use the onboard computer or your phone app to adapt the power curve and engine braking level. To cope with range anxiety, the bike received a powerful 4 kilowatt quick charger that can get you back on the road in just 69 miles. Old Soren Cafe Racer Guys at the Old Soren Motorcycle Company decided that electric mopeds should not only be compact, lightweight, and practical, but also good looking. So they gave a proper cafe racer design to their first model. The model has a fully blacked out matte paint job with white decals, a low handlebar, a round vintage headlamp, and a brown leather seat with a stitched diamond pattern. Despite giving off a serious motorcycle vibe, it's still a moped that's equipped with a set of pedals and a 72 volt powertrain with three performance settings. The restricted mode is for city riding, while the off-road modes unlock the full potential of the mid-mounted chain-driven electric motor with a 4 kilowatt output and a 72 volt 60 amp hour battery pack. The setup can bring 65 mile per hour speeds, a riding autonomy of up to 90 miles, and fast charging capabilities they can top up the battery to up to 80% level in about four hours. Owlet Bikes Owlet is an upcoming personal electric vehicle by a California-based company. It has a surprisingly small frame that enables great maneuverability with a tight turning radius an attention-grabbing design with retro-futuristic vibes, a plush leather seat, 20-inch fat tires, and a folding construction for easy storage. Although the outlet looks like an e-bike, it can be better characterized as a moped or a pit bike, since it only has the foot pegs and no pedals. So the rider only has to rely on a 3-kilowatt electric motor and a 56-volt, 30-amp-hour battery with up to 60 miles of range autonomy. This motor enables a zippy acceleration from 0 to 20 miles per hour in 2.75 seconds, while the top speed is capped at 30 miles per hour. Droog X Boromax TT1600R E-Bike this is a special edition of the Boromax TT1600R that has been modified by the custom bike shop Droog Motors. The model is set apart by a wide moto bar, Droog's custom slashed lights, a 3D printed front fender, an angular tank, and a handmade subframe. There's also a custom suede seat. The drivetrain system of the TT1600R remains unchanged, 
It gets a 1600-watt DC motor and 23.4 amp-hour battery. This is enough for 32 miles per hour speeds and a range of 30 miles. Charging can be done in 4 to 6 hours. Other mechanical components of the bike include standard 180mm disc brakes, inverted style front forks, and a fully adjustable rear shock. As before, the compact bike could suit a variety of riders, even those who are over 6 feet tall. Obarter PT The new Obarter PT merges the properties of a high-performance off-road scooter with the minibike form factor. Since this manufacturer is known for making some of the most capable e-scooters in the world, it's not surprising to see the PT model equipped with a dual-motor setup rated for 12 kilowatts. This personal electric vehicle is rolling on a set of 13-inch fat tires that provide decent grip in off-road conditions, while a full suspension configuration makes the ride as smooth as possible. With a curb weight of 171 pounds, the PT scooter can carry riders up to 330 pounds and reach 75 mile per hour speeds. Other standard equipment includes dual hydraulic brakes, a control app, a remote unlock feature, a lighting setup with turn signals, and a 72 volt 80 amp hour battery with 155 miles of range. EGO Power Plus Mini Bike EGO is world known as a manufacturer of electric power tools and appliances. Now, they'll try out their expertise of spinning electric motors within the realm of two wheelers. The EGO Power Plus Mini Bike benefits from the peak power technology and can utilize any two EGO Power 56 volt arc lithium batteries. Its rear hub motor can operate in three riding modes Eco, Normal, and Sport. The former will extend the range to 20 miles, while the latter would allow you to reach a speed of 28 miles per hour. The Ego Power Plus Mini rides on off-road tires with an aggressive tread, gets dual disc brakes, and a full suspension setup. This motorcycle is equipped with a digital display that reflects all the info and has a parental control restriction mode if you want to share the bike with the younglings. Fellow FW03. The creators of one of the coolest performance electric scooters have recently unveiled an exciting new project. It's a compact motorcycle that weighs 213 pounds, has a turning radius of 5 feet, and wants to combine the benefits of a commuter scooter with the thrills of riding a pit bike. FW03 has a seat height of 30 inches and a bright retro inspired look. It uses a mid mounted 3 kilowatt motor with a 5 kilowatt peak output and 23 pound-feet torque indicators. With a 72-volt, 58-amp-hour pack, this setup can bring 50 mile per hour speeds and up to 74 miles of zero-emission riding. The standard configuration includes front and rear disc brakes, knobby tires, an LCD instrument panel, LED lights, an NFC key, a reverse assist system, and a charger that can get you back on the road in four hours. Rumble Apex Predator It seems that Rumble Motors reconsidered its identity and switched from making moped-style bicycles to electric motorcycles. The company has recently unveiled a future model called the Apex Predator. Based on the company's best-selling e-bike, the Apex Predator retains a tubular frame underneath the matte black angular bodywork but completely loses the pedals. The performance now comes from a powerful belt-driven mid-drive motor with a 12-kilowatt output. To ensure peak performance at speeds up to 75 miles per hour, the bike could be equipped with either a single 72 volt 42 amp hour battery or a dual 72 volt 40 amp hour pack. The powertrain has three performance settings offering from 60 to 130 miles of riding. In its base configuration, you're also getting a full suspension, 17 inch spoked wheels with Michelin tires, a round headlight, and an alarm system.
Kugo Wish 01. Kugo engineers and designers decided to apply their expertise in producing e-bikes and scooters in a new vehicle class. The new Wish 01 is a dual-purpose mini motorcycle that works as a lightweight tool for getting around the city or a pit bike for endless off-road adventures. The newcomer has compact dimensions, a 27.5-inch seat height, 40.7-inch wheelbase, and 9.8 inches of ground clearance. Its low weight of 83.7 pounds is the result of the use of an aluminum alloy frame. Wish 01 also supports mismatch wheels with 14-inch front tires and 12-inch rear off-road tires, hydraulic brakes, and a full suspension setup with adjustable shock absorbers in the rear. The performance comes from a 1.5 kilowatt mid-mounted motor with a chain drive and a 48-volt 16-amp-hour battery pack. With the 3 kilowatt peak output, the bike can carry riders up to 265 pounds, reach speeds up to 34 miles per hour, and cover 30 miles on a charge. In terms of specifications, you get a bike with a 7.2 kilowatt motor with 14 kilowatt peak output capabilities and a 4.8 kilowatt hour lithium battery pack. With such powertrain, you'd be able to cover distances up to 50 miles while cruising at speeds up to 44 miles per hour. It can also climb hills with up to 35 degrees of incline and carry the payload of 300 pounds. The list of standard components includes a heavy-duty fork and shocks, disc brakes, bright LED headlights, and IP67 waterproof rating. The all-season capabilities of this model come courtesy of one interesting engineering solution a conversion kit that consists of a front ski and a rear track intended to turn your motorcycle into a snowmobile. Our team is working hard on bringing the latest and greatest news from the world of electric two-wheelers. If you'd like to support our efforts, please subscribe for further updates and feel free to share our work with your friends or request new product reviews in the comments section below. Thanks once again and till next time.